Hey guys, the wet one back here again for yet another unboxing video for you guys today. This one's gonna be shot on two different occasions uh, right now because I know I, I know I have some other things coming, but I also have these uh, that showed up right here. So after I unbox these, I'll snap my fingers and be transported to a few days later unboxing some other stuff. But uh, this one right here was sent to my PO box. And so were these, but I believe I know these are trades that I did uh, in the autograph trade group that I'm a part of. But uh, so I, I, I kind of know what those ones are. But this one, this one right here, like I said, was sent to my PO box, and uh, there's an address on it. Just you know, it says um, I don't know if you guys can read it on the packaging or not, but it says uh, it doesn't have anybody's name on it, but it says hot sauce for your butthole. The package says hot sauce for your butthole. That's the return address's name. So uh, <laughs> it also has like an Amazon, it's like also an Amazon package. But if you guys like my videos, please hit that thumbs up button, man. Support them in any way. Follow me on my Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Links in the description. But let's open this up and see. Oh, what's in here? Why is it like all that white stuff? Okay. All right. All right. Let's open this up. Hot sauce for my butthole. Is there like a, a thing in here? Is there a note? Uh, send a thank you note. You can learn. Uh, yeah, there's nothing on here that says who it's from. But it says, if it's hot sauce from my butthole, you guys know I do hot sauce challenge videos. So what is this? What the hell is this? Oh shit! Uh, Steve-O's hot sauce for your butthole. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's uh, Steve-O from Jackass. He has his own hot sauce. Steve, Steve-O's hot sauce for your butthole. Um, I'm def I'll definitely try this out for an upcoming video for sure. And thank you to whoever it was, whoever it was that sent this, uh, you know, to, to the P.O. box and stuff. If anybody ever wants to send anything, you know, to me to try out on video, like hot sauce, hot sauce wise or spicy food wise or, you know, anything that you'd like me to open up on video or try on video. Feel free, you know, I have my P.O. Box address is in the description box uh, of my videos here. Definitely look, 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 look forward to a video in the future, real near, near future, of me putting this on something and trying this Stevo's hot sauce for your butthole. Oh my god. <laughs> that's amazing. That's, that, that's, um, that, that's secretly, secretly amazing. And uh, this one right here is coming from uh, a trade, a trade, an autograph trade I did. It's not a, it's not a BAM box. Or anything like that. The person has put it in, into a BAM box. But uh, I think I probably need scissors for this. Unless I just power through it. Unless I just power through this. Let's see. Let's see if I can just power through this. I think I remember what I traded. What I, what I traded. Autograph wise in here. But let's see if I can open this up. Let's see. Let's see. Ah! Ah! Get in here. Get in here. Okay, there we go. I don't know if you guys saw it or not. We got BAM paper in there. Is there a note? Is there a note? Nope, there is no note. But this item, oh yeah, there is a note. There is a note on here. It says, um, hey Brendan, thanks for doing this autograph trade with me. Uh, I threw in an extra art print that I uh, thought you would like because it's from such a great movie. Uh, hope you have uh, a wonderful holiday. Well, thank you, Marie. Uh, she's also a YouTuber. Uh, as well, but off the top of my head, as I'm filming this, I'm forgetting her YouTube name. But as of, as, as you're watching this, I'll probably have her YouTube name pop up here on the screen. Make sure you guys subscribe to her. I'll, have, I'll try to have a link for her channel in the description box of this video. Um, I think I, tra I traded her. I traded her the um, uh, Nick Castle uh, autograph I had. The Nick Castle uh, autograph I had for this, and um, yeah, because yeah, I got this one right here, which is JS JSA authenticated. It's an eight by ten craft. Uh, you know, uh, poster photo uh, right here, signed by Farusa Valk. Uh, Farusa Valk, uh, you know, who played, uh, you know, the main, the main girl of the flick, next to Nev Campbell and the other girls. Farusa Valk, Valk, uh, you know, from the craft, and she was also in like, you know, um, Return to Oz and a whole bunch of other really cool things. A little autograph uh, piece from her, a little eight by ten JSA authenticated. Oh, and <laughs> the art, the art print that she included, I think it was part of a band box. She said, is the Goonies one with Chunk and Sloth. On it, hey you guys! 
That is super cool, man. Thank you so much, Marie. And I feel so bad. I forget the name of the, you, you, your YouTube channel, but I've been watching it for like a handful of months now or even longer than that. I'm not going to lie. But thank you for doing the trade with me. Hopefully the item I sent you, the Nick Castle, uh, got there and, and, you know, nice and safe. It was the first time I ever shipped a photo, uh, an autographed picture to somebody. So hopefully it got there safe. This other package right here is coming from my homegirl, April, a uh, nerdy mom uh, here on YouTube. I have a link for her YouTube channel as well in the description box. Uh, I traded her uh, a Funko Pop that was autographed by Barbara Eden, my little I Dream of Genie Funko Pop, uh, for this that's inside here. And you guys, when you guys see what it is, you, you, some of you guys may go, on, you, some of you guys may go, why did you trade that for this? I don't know. I'm nuts. I'm nuts. I, I, plus, I, li I like this person, and the person that signed this is no longer with us anymore. Is, uh, is no longer with us anymore. And it's just, it's just, it, just, it just fits my collection a little bit better uh, than the Barbara Eden Funko Pop. Because I'm not the biggest, um, you know, Funko Pop collector. I mean, I have some, and you'll probably see me open up some more later on in this video. But, um, you know, this is what, okay, this is, this, this is what the person traded. I gave her the Funko Pop. And I got this in return, which is also J JSA, you know, JSA authenticated. And it's a, um, a Playboy cover, a Playboy cover signed by a person that's no longer with us. And that is China, autographed by China. She was a wrestler I always thought was kind of cool. Never had a crush on her or anything like that. But I, I always thought she was kind of badass in the Generation X. And, uh, you know, doing her, her, her woman thing, you know, wh whooping men's asses back in the, you know, WWF days, WWE days. And uh, I really wanted to meet her. She was supposed to be at uh, son of, uh, one of the Monster Palooza shows uh, a couple years ago. And a couple days before the event happened, she passed away. And they even had, like, flowers at her, um, uh, at her table, uh, you know, because she was supposed to be there. It was just, it was, it was, I really wanted to meet her and stuff and things like that. But it's just, it's, it's, not, a, it's not the actual magazine. It's just, like, you know, a, a, a print of the cover that she autographed a handful of years ago, obviously, before she passed away. It says China XOXO, you know, on there in gold. I think that's pretty killer, man. JSA authenticated. So that, that's what I got so far uh, for this unboxing right here. These two autographed photos that I did in trades and uh, Steve-O's hot sauce for your butthole uh, right here. But right now, guys, let's cut to the other part of the video uh, that's going to happen in a couple days when I get some other stuff that I know is coming in the mail. All right. Now it's been a day or two since the last part of this video. Got more stuff sent in the mail. This box coming from Primetime Signatures. And I uh, also got these other uh, packages here on top. Uh, so it's time to keep on unboxing uh, in this video right now. So let's get to these screener ones first. Or, you know, um, free Blu-rays and DVDs I get from different companies that talk about and showcase some videos and stuff. Uh, this one right here uh, is coming from Paramount, I think. I think, I think this one's coming from Paramount. Ooh, okay, okay, and this is the 4K Blu-ray digital copy combo pack of a movie called Love and Monsters. Uh, I, heard, I heard some pretty good things about this one right here. Uh, this one says certified fresh uh, from Rotten Tomatoes uh, right there. Looks pretty damn cool. Expect, uh, expect me to talk about this one in an upcoming, you know, uh, Tuesday video uh, when I do my, uh, you know, review, my, my review portions uh, at the end of the Tuesday video. So let's see when this one comes out. Um, let's see here, comes out January 5th, 2021, uh, and should be in stores everywhere and on digital if you want to get Love and Monsters. If you guys have seen this movie, please let me know. What do you guys think about it? Because I obviously haven't seen it yet, just got it in the mail. And this one, I'm not sure where it's coming from. This one says it's, it's coming from FedEx, and it was uh, overnighted to me, overnighted to me over here. Not sure what company it is, so I guess we'll find out as we open it together. And that is, oh, okay, okay. This is from uh, Universal, and it's called The War with Grandpa uh, here. Uh, kind of, I was kind of interested in checking this one out. It has Christopher Walken in there, along with, of course, you know, Robert De Niro and stuff. And Uma Thurman, okay. Okay, a great family comedy. Uh, it says, I always like, you know, dumb, stupid kind of, you know, uh, you know, comedy stuff. Like, ever since, like, I saw De Niro and, like, Meet the Fuckers, I kind of like him in comedy movies. I'm not gonna lie, I always thought he was kind of entertaining. But, uh, yeah, the, the War with Grandpa, that was one of those ones that came out, uh, you know, during this pandemic and stuff, and, and select theaters and, like, drive drive-ins and stuff. And this other one, I'm not sure what, which one this is coming from either. It doesn't really say on the, on the, on the packaging itself. So let's see, the, the other one is... Oh, okay. 
This is from Universal 2, and it's called The Honest Thief. The new Liam Neeson Honest Thief movie. Looks like another one of those movies, like, you know, like, taken in a way. Because that's all I can really kind of do these days. I think I think Hollywood's kind of typecasting him and doing the semi, you know, the, the same kind of sort of things. Uh, the same kind of roles, you know, in a way. You know what I'm saying? It seems like it. But, hey, brothers need, bro, he's just trying to make his money. He's just out there trying to make his cheddar. And uh, this one comes out on, um, let's see what the paperwork says. Uh, December uh, 29th, at the end of December, uh, on Blu-ray and DVD in stores uh, everywhere. If you guys like Liam Neeson, stay tuned for that uh, in stores in stores soon. But thank you, um, uh, Paramount and Universal, for sending these review copies on over uh, for me to showcase for a video right now. I'll definitely be talking about them after I watch them and give you guys my thoughts and opinions uh, on them. But right now... Let's get on over to this box, uh, this mystery box. It's not really a mystery to me, but it'll be, it's a mystery to you guys. But this is coming from Primetime Signatures. Uh, this is the company that holds private signings and even um, goes out on the streets and gets autographs from different celebrities and stuff. And uh, I believe the, this one, the ones in here were acquired from private signings uh, that they had. And uh, if you guys want to follow Primetime Signatures on Facebook, you can. It's called they, they call themselves on Facebook Autograph City, which they do mystery boxes where you can like, you know, you know, pop, you know, pay, you know, pay into one, and uh, they open up a box uh, on video. And uh, if, if you don't want to know what the mystery is, they'll they'll just send it to you if you don't watch their live show. But this right here, I know what it is because I watched their live unboxing that they did uh, on their Facebook page. So let's open this up. Uh, this is part of their uh, Funko Mania. They had an autograph uh, mystery box uh, for you know autograph Funko Pops. I, I got I I I, I bought in. To their uh, Funko Mania, which is like the autographed Funko Pops uh, that they that they have, that, like a whole show dedicated to Funko, Funko Pops, and I, uh, you know, I, I think I, yeah, I bought into two of their mystery boxes uh, that they had, which is, you know, you can either get one uh, signed Funko Pop or sometimes multiple ones, and uh, I'm just gonna show you guys what I got. Got my little baby scissors here. Come in, come in, come on in. Come in, open, open, come in, come in, come in. You open for daddy? You open for daddy? Come on, open for daddy. It's full of paper. Take things out, little by little. It's still a mystery to me. And a mystery to you. And for you guys who don't know, they have a little, little thing in here. Because they're having a private signing uh, with Emilio Estevez and um, Rain Wilson uh, at the end of the month. Uh, if you guys want to get a private, if you want to get anything signed by them, check out PrimetimeSignatures.com. Uh, I have a link to their website in the description box uh, of this video. Amelia Estevez. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, this, this is this is what I won. Part of their Funko Mania mystery box, right here. I'm gonna show you the big one first, and then the smaller one second. This one's uh, bubble wrap like crazy. And keep in mind, um. The person that autographed this Funko Pop, I got an auto already got an autograph from before, but to get it on this item is kind of badass. It's kind of badass. So let's see. Let's see what it looks like in person. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, okay, we got the Beckett card up in there. Oh, and like I said, all their stuff's Beckett certified or you know JSA certified and stuff. Man. I, I'm definitely going to reuse this bubble wrap for my, my eBay store. Link in the description box for my eBay store. If anybody wants to support the channel in any, any way, you can. Boom, 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 boom. Damn, I'm definitely going to be reusing this bubble wrap for other stuff. But you guys can probably sort of see what it is already. It's probably, it's one, it's one of the bigger, it's one of the bigger Funko Pops that's out there. And it's, uh, you know, Beckett certified. You see the Beckett card uh, on the back right here. It's the Beckett number, you know, a sticker on the side. But this is a Jaws. This is a Jaws Funko Pop, autographed by Richard Dreyfuss. How cool is that? I believe he's one of the, one of the only living uh, actors from the film that that are that's still around, give or take. Like I think there's this one lady that's still around uh, from from the franchise. But yeah, I got a Funko Pop autograph, Jaws Funko Pop autographed by Richard Dreyfuss, man. From you know, uh, what's it called? Um, Close Encounters of the Third Kind and Mr. Holland's Opus. The other Funko Pop that I won uh, in one of their uh, mystery mystery boxes that they had uh, going on is this. It's, a, it's one of their regular size ones, but this autograph is kind of badass, and it, to be honest, but like I wish it was on a different pop. I wish it was on a different Funko Pop, and I'm not really a big Funko Pop collector. 
You know what I'm saying? You guys know this already. The only ones I have are the ones I got recently. And, um... But this one is to get... To have an autograph. To have a Star Wars Funko Pop autograph is kind of cool. And that is, um... Am I going to get this out of here? Okay, I don't even know how to say this character's name. Because, like I said, it was a mystery. I didn't I didn't get to pick, you know, what, what Funko Pop I was getting. It was, it was all a mystery. And, uh, cool. It's in a Funko... It's in a Funko protector. And, uh... It's from the, from the movie Star Wars... Um... What's it called again? Star Wars Rogue One. And it's a, a Funko Pop of uh, uh, Wheat Tiffy. Uh, Wheat Tiffy is one of those, like, you know, um, characters that you see in the Star Wars franchise. You're like, wait, who is that again? You know, kind of thing. But, um, like, I don't even, I'm not going to lie, I don't even remember this character at all. But it is uh, signed by the star that played this character in Star Wars Rogue One, and uh, it's just it's just kind of cool uh, to have some autograph by him. I, I I wish it was I wish they had a Funko Pop that I that I won of Willow because this one right here is autographed by Warwick Davis, and of course it's Beckett certified. It has the Beckett card, uh, I believe. I believe inside the inside inside the Funko Pop it has the Beckett number, you know, on the side and everything. So th this is what this is what I. Uh, this is what I won from uh, Primetime Signatures and Autograph City's, um, you know, Funko Pop mystery box, uh, you know, that they had. Like I said, it was just a mystery. You never, you didn't really know what you were going to get unless you watched the live unboxing, you know, on their thing. An autographed Jaws Funko Pop signed by Richard Dreyfus, and Warwick Davis signed uh, Star Wars Funko Pop. He, I guess he played one of those characters in the movie. Now on to the last package uh, of this video right here. Uh, this one's sent from Primetime Signatures. The same people that brought me the autograph Funko Pops you guys saw just a moment ago. This one right here uh, was sent as a gift from the main man, Charles, from Primetime Signatures uh, right here. So let's see uh, what this gift entails. But like, you know, he was, he was doing this, you know, as a... As a, you know, just being a cool guy. Just being a cool guy. And it's like, it's kind of, it's kind of like, you know, bendy in here. It's like, I'm hopefully, hopefully it didn't get like, you know, bent up in shipping or anything. But this is, this is definitely going to be uh, a, a cool autograph piece to add to my collection. Because uh, uh, Char uh, Charles, over at PrimetimeSignatures.com, uh, which I'll have a, a link for in the description box, um, is holding a private signing. Uh, with this person uh, com coming up in the next uh, like next week or two, you know what I'm saying? Like real real soon. So if you guys want to get up on anything from him, you're gonna have to get up on it quick. You guys will see what it is in just a oh, it's all taped up real good. Okay, uh, but as soon as you guys see what this is, you'll know what I'm talking about. The, they held a private signing with this person before, and they're they're doing it again. But uh, this is this one. This piece right here is coming from one of their previous signings that they they had. And uh, I'm just like, I got to get this. I have to, please, man. This will be killer to add to my collection. Okay, I have to move the cardboard. And then now it's in, it's in, it's in an eBay, uh, an eBay packs, package right here. And uh, let me open this up. I, hopefully, hopefully it's not all bent up or anything. Everything seems to be cool. Here, you, you guys are going to see it before I do. This is what uh, Primetime Signatures sent me, uh, you know, uh, as, as a gift right here. And, if you guys want to get something like this signed by the, the same person, you can, because they're holding a private signing with Emilio Estevez. And uh, this one right here is Beckett, uh, is Beckett authenticated, and, it ha and they're, you know, they're having a private signing with um, Emilio Estevez and uh, Rain Wilson coming up. And uh, this is just a you know, thing to promote, their, to promote their website and promote what's going on with them. They, if you want like autograph memorabilia or you know, like auto autograph pictures and stuff, you can. But this is an autographed... Uh, mini poster of my one of my top five favorite movies of all time, The Breakfast Club, signed by Emilio Estevez, right here with the Beckett authenticated sticker, the Beckett card uh, on the back. How sweet is that, dude? I think this is a 11 by 18, uh, 11 by 18 piece right here. Definitely check out uh, Primetime Signatures, man, if you guys want to get a piece like this to add to your collection. Cause like I said, they're having an Emilio signing, a private signing yet again. I believe Emilio. Uh, does one signing every year, and I think I think Primetime Signatures is, is the place that they do it with, or, or he does it with, you know. But this is just a, a beautiful, a beautiful piece to add, uh, you know, to my collection since this is one of my favorite movies of all time. If you guys have watched my YouTube channel long enough, you already know 
definitely the top five films uh, of all time. Now, and to get it autographed by Emilio Estevez, a, per, a, per, a person that you never see do conventions, that is super killer, man. But Charles, thank you so much, brother, for hooking me up with that poster, man. I'm so glad I got in uh, on your um, mystery boxes for the Funko Pops. That was super cool. But guys, check out Primetime Signatures if you want to get an autograph by... Um, Rain Wilson or uh, you know Amelia Westavez are having private signings uh, with these with these guys at the end of the month. So um, if you guys want to order something, you can. Link is in the description box. And for anyone that buys something from that link, uh, it'll let them know that you're you're coming from my video. So I think that's kind of cool. It's the first time I ever you know got a, any kind of special link to uh, you know so people know that I'm, I'm you know I'm talking about a website. You know it's it's kind of cool. You know what I mean? Charles, the guy that runs the company, is really dope. But guys, that's all I have to show for you. Show you guys for this unboxing video today. Uh, thank you, thank you so much, Charles and Primetime Signatures. I really do appreciate it, and thank you guys all for watching and supporting the videos. I love you guys all, and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Whoosh.